Starting a new business is always a scary venture. Marquetta Breslin was researching ideas for starting her own business a few years ago and never imagined it would one day help her mother through her battle with cancer. Now she is teaching others her trade. So we have her here with us today. She is president and CEO of the Lacewig Training Center. Thank you so much for being with us. Thank you for having me. Now I think a lot of people are looking at the situation now, whether they have lost their job or maybe saying, you know what, I'm not really happy with what I'm doing and looking to start their own business or get into a new venture. What was your motivation behind deciding to go into business for yourself? Um, well, my biggest motivation was my husband. Um, we actually didn't start with the Lacewick Training Center. We started with a bigger website, Braids by Breslin. And from there, I was getting emails and emails on top of emails of customers who had alopecia or who were lo losing their hair due to cancer. And they wanted an alternative to the traditional wig that was available. So um, I decided to find something for them. And in doing my research, I came across lace wigs and um, while I was doing this my own mother was diagnosed with breast cancer during that time and um, she lost all of her hair mm -hmm. due to chemo and I made her a piece and I saw what it did for her it totally changed her life she was more confident she felt good about herself and she didn't have to worry about whether or not people knew she was going through this and it just made her feel better so I felt like I had to do something, I had to share my knowledge with other people so that they too can change lives for um, cancer patients, people going through alopecia um, and things of that nature. So I felt like that, that's something that I really, really needed to do. How important uh, being a woman, you know, and of course being a man, but how important do women identify themselves with their hair? Um, I've always believed that our hair is our crown of glory. Um, and when my mother lost her hair, it, I think it was more devastating for me mm -hmm. than it was for her. Um, I couldn't bear, t I, I didn't want to see it. I didn't want to, I was just so, I was, I, I, the feelings were, I can't Almost believe it. Helpless. it was, right, and it was overwhelming. And um, the feedback that I get from other women that are going through this, I, they cry, they, they just don't feel good about themselves. So I feel... Um, our, our hair is our crown and glory. Mm -hmm. so. And you're able to help make that difference. So yes. how did you then move forward with your business to train other people? Once um, I saw the change in my mom, I decided at that point that it was time for me to um, do something about it so that other people can do what I did. So six months later, and uh, about 200 hours or more of filming, mm -hmm. I developed a system called the Lacewick Training System. And it is a six DVD, two workbook, and two workbooks, and it's a whole bunch of other cool mm -hmm. stuff in the system that teaches people how to do this from scratch. Um, and you start with a small project and you work your way up to the bigger projects. I don't know, you have your YouTube videos, we saw a little bit of that there, mm -hmm. but you also do some seminars. So what is your website so people know how to get in touch with you if they are interested in finding out more? Sure, the website is www.lacewigtrainingcenter.com. And the seminars are going well, it's a lot of hands-on, um, and it just br brings everything all together from the system and the seminars, the hands-on. I give everybody, you know, ample time to ask me questions and things like that, and they've really been doing well. And the thing that is the most rewarding to me is to have someone go through my seminars and my training, and they email me and say, look what I did for mm -hmm. my client. I, and, and the client going from the before and after, it's amazing. It's amazing, and that is never gonna get old. That's, that's so rewarding for me, and I'm just so blessed and happy to be able to do that. Certainly an inspiration and, and a rebirth for all of those women who are going through cancer and, and dealing with that fight, and they've got that extra support that sometimes they might not otherwise have. So Marquetta, thank yeah. you for sharing that inspirational story. You're welcome, thank you.